Hey folks, Homer Obara back here once again for GameSpot.com and San Diego Comic Con 2013 is kicking off. And of course, I made a beeline straight to Video Game Alley because you know what? I want to see some damn video games here at the show. Right behind me, the console wars are continuing. We got the Xbox One over there and the PlayStation uh, whole setup here. It looks like they got some PS4 action, but let's jump right into the Sony booth because uh, they got a bunch of stuff playable here. And um, as you can see on this side, they've got a bunch of PlayStation Vita games here. They got Killzone, Mercenary, Dragon's Crown. Dude, give me the lowdown on Dragon's Crown real quick. Uh, let me Whoa! Get... Yeah, yeah? You want this man right behind you? Okay, let's. Yes! Oh my gosh! Dude, Aram, how are you? I'm good. Dude, are uh, we live? We're not live, All right. but we will be at some point. Okay. Dude, give us the lowdown. Aram, I, I didn't even. It's good to see you. It's great to see you, man. Say it say on the spot. Say today, today on the today spot. Today on the spot. Tears are in heaven yeah? right now. Yeah. Is that, did that just bring like a moment of peace and like you know serenity? It felt like for me, it felt like a hundred puppies just giggling, like barking in my okay. chest. Like awesome. it's funny feelings. It's awesome. <laughs> uh, you, you got the haircut going yeah. because you're looking slick. Yeah, and absolutely. you're showing off some some uh, Vita stuff. What well, do we got? Well, or we, some PlayStation in general. PlayStation in general, man. We're an ecosystem. Yeah, I mean, you look at the PlayStation 4, you look yep. at the PlayStation Vita, mm -hmm. the PS3. We have powerful, sleek yes. hardware, so we're going sleek we're going here. Going sleek. It's all uh, good. I like it. Yeah, we are. We're. This is the first public hands-on for the PlayStation 4 here at Comic Con. Uh, so let's jump right into that. Give, yeah, me, give me the lowdown. All right. Uh, well, so you're, I'm guessing you're familiar with the PlayStation 4. I've heard of it. Yeah, you've heard of it. <laughs> uh, we're excited to show Knack, okay. Drive Club. We actually have a, a super cool competition going on here with a leaderboard that we're going to ask people to come and check out. Nice. And we have Octodad. Our friends at Young Horses mm -hmm. are here showing off one of the funniest, quirkiest indie games. And we're so honored to have developers like that working on our system. Well, let's go check it out. Let's see what people can, can play right now. We got Knack right here, right? Give us a, an example of what folks are going to be able to play. You got a bunch of boxes here on display here. Uh, yeah, yeah, you're talking about the systems? I'm talking about the games, the systems, yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Well, so we have Knack on display. For anyone who's not aware, this is a kind of an action platformer. Yep. Uh, it's, you know, if you've played a game like a God of War, although you know there's a lot less viscera here, um, you kind of get a feel for how it's going to play. And it's obviously, it's vibrant, it's colorful, it's fun. One of the most important aspects of Knack is that it's designed for hardcore gamers and someone who's new to gaming to be able to equally pick it up, get right into it. It's kind of a very simple but deep game design. And, of course, uh, it's, it's, it shows off, the, it showcases the gaming system uh, power. You got the physics engine on display, and uh, yeah, I mean, people, people seem to just be getting on and enjoying it. Dude, so where are we at in terms of the game, in, sort of, in terms of the storyline? Is that something that we can talk about, or is this kind of just an example of what the the yeah. breadth of what the game is going to involve. So the demo doesn't offer, I think, a ton of context yet in, in terms of story. It gives you an example of what Knack can do. And Knack uh, can build up in size as he collects parts from things he destroys. He can also take on special abilities based on what he's absorbing. Nice. Uh, that mechanic obviously goes over the course of the game. Uh, Knack is basically a, an army. Uh, for these team of scientists, right. and he, uh, you can see the kind of destruction he's able to do on his own. He's tossing cars into these aerial uh, vehicles. So he can havoc, dude. He can havoc. Oh my gosh. Absolutely. All right. So let's. You, you obviously got more games. Let's let's go check those out too. So uh, how are you doing so so far? I mean, it's the show's just kicked off. Yes. It, it looks like the floodgates have opened. People are here. Yes. Octodad. Let's talk about Octodad, Dadly is Catch. Dad, Dadly is Catch. We, can we pull one of these guys in? Sure, let's do it. Let's, let's pull someone in. So uh, this, is, this is Homer hey, from GameSpot. Hey, how's it going, man? Hi there. What's your name? I'm Kevin Zoon. What's up, Kevin Zoon? How you doing? I'm doing great. Well, let's talk about Octodad. All right. What, what, what are you? <laughs> what are you? We're, putting, we're putting him on the spot. Here. We are. You are on the spot. What do you guys uh, show? What's... What's the, what's the demo uh, involving right here at so, Comic-Con? So Octodad here, he's at his wedding. Nice. He's getting married to his beautiful wife. All right. Uh, but he's got to get ready. He's got to put on a hat. He's got to get his suit and tie. And he's got to walk down the aisle and not slip on any banana peels. Oh, wow. That's a tall order. It is. He's, <laughs> there's a lot of wedding guests. He doesn't want them to know that he's an octopus. So, okay. so he's, he's hiding all of it. Oh, yeah. He's got his work cut out for him. So let's talk about what the what kind of functionality we got going on there. What is this guy doing right here? Uh, currently, so put a key into something. yeah, he's trying to open up this cabinet. Uh, he's trying to grab the cabinet, and so the 
you want to know about the controls? Sure, yeah, please do. Uh, so uh, there's like a legs mode and an arms mode. Okay. And in the arms mode, you use the left stick to move in the horizontal axis, the right stick to move in the vertical axis, and then uh, the, the R1 grabs onto objects, cool. so he sticks his tentacle to it, or let's go, and then you hit uh, left one to go into your legs mode. Nice. You use the left and right triggers in order to lift your left and right legs and use the thumbsticks to, to kind of move his legs around. Very cool. All right. So that's Octodad, Dadliest Catch. I'm getting the, the wrap it up sign from our, from our producer back here. Aram, thanks. For, just give us a quick rundown what people can get their hands on at the show floor. Absolutely. Well, we've got tremendous Thank third you, party me. partners here. The Walking Dead is here on Vita. Batman Arkham Origins nice. is here uh, on, on PS3 and, and Black 8 on Vita. We've got The Puppeteer, right. Beyond Two Souls, nice. uh, Diablo 3. We're so stoked. We have it here on PS3. It's so cool to play that game on a gamepad. Cool. And of course, we have a ton of great Vita stuff as well. Killzone Mercenary, Terror. Away. If you're in uh, San Diego, if you've got come access by. to Comic Con, come by. Just, come just in. come by, play come some by. games. Absolutely. Jeez. Absolutely. That's come not by. a hard sell. Not a hard sell at all. <laughs> Aram, thanks for joining us, man. Absolutely. Appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your show. We're here at the Sony booth. Play some PlayStation 4 games. San Diego Comic Con is happening, folks. So let's go back to the stage right now.